Performing a portable chest X-ray in patients with COVID-19 or under investigation for COVID-19 in the emergency department or the hospital wards. This is a standard operating procedure and can be used as a checklist and this is based on the British Society of Thoracic Imaging Action Cards. This is aimed at patients who are at risk of having COVID-19 where portable chest x-ray imaging should be done in dedicated areas. Activation is usually by the medical staff who asks for a chest x-ray. They should identify the patient as requiring a chest x-ray and the radiology request highlights that the patient is at risk of COVID-19 or is a patient with confirmed COVID-19. What are the steps? The radiology department should identify suitably trained and fit tested staff to undertake the portable chest x-ray and agree the location of the examination. Only the portable x-ray machine should be used. Appropriate fit tested radiographers should perform the examination. The staff should be careful to wear the correct PPEs as shown in the image, which includes the face shield and goggles, the N95 respirator, isolation gown and disposable gloves. Always try to work in pairs whenever possible. Place the DR detector in a protective bag. Perform the examination and ensure the chest x-ray obtained is diagnostic so as to avoid repeat chest x-rays. Leave the room once the examination is complete, making sure to take all your equipment with you and go to a clean area. Dispose of the detector cover in a clinical waste bin and do not touch the detector with gloves but still disinfect. Dispose of all PPEs in the clinical waste bin. Once this is done, wash your hands and put on another clean gown and a pair of gloves. Wipe the detector and the portable machine with the appropriate disinfectant as instructed by the vendors. Dispose the PPE, wash your hands and return to the department and process the image. Stand down. Once the patient is confirmed as no longer at risk, Patients can present to the radiology department for any imaging provided that their clinical condition allows. This is an action card of the standard operating procedure that was released by the British Society of Thoracic Imaging and is available as a PDF on the link below.